Hi, this is my um, film of my bike ride in Kunkan in uh, South Wales. Second time I've ridden this. And this is me, all keen and ready to go. So looking at the map here, we're starting out where all the blue bits are with the car park and heading up to the top right hand side. And that's all uphill to begin with. So this ride's virtually all single track and once you're at the car park, and this was um, midweek, so it wasn't too busy. That's the uh, downhill section, which I haven't ridden. So basically you're following, there is a, um, a scenic road going parallel to the single track there. So it follows the, the road up the valley. So the single track goes up through the forest. It's all properly designed. And most of it's rideable. Uh, I had to push a little bit of it now and again. Uh, eventually it comes out and it joins up with the uh, scenic road here. And this is where you pay if you're going to ride the cars free if you're riding a bike. And it carries on further up the valley. There's me again, it's looking good. So it's still climbing up through the valley, steady uphill, and going up to the car park at uh, Giant's Court. Yeah, I love these uh, switchbacks, really cool. cool. So I was um, taking my time, I was no, no hurry, enjoying the ride and the, and the fresh air in the afternoon. So I took some time out to have some uh, something to eat and uh, a drink. And I was playing around with my new octopus tripod and taking some film. Good time to go midweek because it's pretty quiet and uh, there's only a few people out riding. And look at the map here, so we're a bit further up, we're going to follow the top of the red line to the top now. So this next section is uh, is where it zigzags and it, you can see as I'm shooting up it's quite steep here so the uh, there's more of a switchback system of through the forest beautiful section so it takes you up gradually and this is looking back down to the car park yeah but it's quite steep and it was a beautiful afternoon very nice this is September so early autumn in in South Wales. Anyway, as you can see, I, I like this section because I've taken so much film. But eventually, you do get to the top. Oh, you can if you want. I believe there's an up lift service where you can get your bike taken up for you on the back of a, a van. That's cheating, though. So at the top here, you basically have a choice of doing the black route or the red, carry on with the red route. So I really do recommend you go down the black route. So the red route is just down the right. And there's the black route where that flag thing is. So you follow it down there. Yeah, there's the red route. That's a better shot. So you get a pretty good view here. Feels like you're in the middle of nowhere. But you're actually kind of less than 10 miles away from Newport. And this is going down the black route here. And as you can see in the background there, you're gonna you get a terrific view. And this is the view. And what you look this is looking towards the River Severn in the background there. And the city of Newport. And I did take you can just about see the Severn Bridge, but not very clearly. So that's the way I came on the car. So I drove up on the motorway and then drove up the valley. So when I did the ride two years ago, I think it was two years ago, I missed all this. <laughs> so um, it's well worth seeing. I think that's, that's Newport. Uh, this is me filming myself uh, doing a part of this black run. So most of it's pretty straightforward, but this is kind of like twists around. It looks quite easy but it's on the film but it's it's actually quite difficult. It turns around so you do need to have a bit of confidence about doing all this. Yeah, it goes underneath the, the tube there, so it's quite fun. 
Phil makes it look a little easier than it actually is because it's quite a tight turn and it's dropped steeply there. So take a bit of care. Anyway, it twists and turns down and eventually it comes out and meets up with the red route again at the car park here and this uh, another stunning viewpoint. So I was in Ohio in the afternoon and um, decided to go back up and do the red route. So it's only uh, a 10 minute ride back up the road here. Nothing too hard. And the red ride is uh, just as much fun as the black. Most of the uphill sections are now being conquered. So there is a little bit on the way back on the last third. But uh, most of it's the fun bit now. It's either going along and seeing these terrific views or it's downhill all the way back to the start. So this is really the fun bit of the ride where you can relax a bit. So you can see how these towns uh, snake along the valley floor here. Very typical South Wales. And they're surrounded by beautiful scenery. And some great mountain biking. As usual, I don't film the downhill sections. That you're just going to have to trust me is really great fun. And you're going to have to ride them yourselves. Finally, here's me. Not too tired. I drove up to Swansea after this to uh, do Afan Forest the next day. So um, plenty to look forward to.